Top ranked gymnasts are in town. We're talking about the US Olympic trials taking place at Target Center this weekend. And there are a bunch of things for fans to do downtown as well. Our Shayla Reeves joining us now to tell us more. And Shayla, you're in our studio because a lot of these markets just right outside. Yes, and of course, you know, we're dealing with all of this rain today. This is the first time Minneapolis has hosted the Olympic gymnastics trials. And really, you don't have to go far to experience the magic of Paris. Ahead of the 2024 Summer Games, there's a transformation happening on Nicollet Mall and of course you could be a part of the fun right now I'm here with Sandy Sweetser executive director of the local organizing committee for Gymnastics City USA thanks so much for being here today thank you for having me yes so good to see you well tell us first about Gymnastics City so Gymnastics City is kind of a culmination of about a year and a half of work that where we are just celebrating the fact that the trials are here, the Olympic trials, as well as we had USA Gymnastics Championships at the Convention Center, and then all of these other activities, Flip Zone presented by Target, Promenade de Nord here on Nicollet Mall. So it's the combination, we're all over the cities. And we're seeing some of those images yeah. of the excitement captured there. Talk a little bit more about this Parisian street fair and the local flair. Yes, yeah, so we really wanted to show everyone who's coming into town that Minneapolis is such a great city and it's so easy to get across. So we created this Parisian street fair on Nicollet Mall between 7th and 11th. And it's basically, we've got 60 local makers, we've got entertainment, mimes, you know, street entertainment, food and beverage. So it's just to kind of bring a little bit of Paris here, celebrating that really the reason these athletes are at trials is to get to Paris. And of course, we know that uh, when they come down here, they'll see that replica of the Eiffel Tower. Yes. Just so many things creating the magic. The flip zone, you can get the autograph mm -hmm. session with gymnastics legends. And talking about what we've seen so far, you said that the men had a pretty good night. We had a great night last night. We had probably, I'm sure, one of their biggest attendance numbers for day one of a men's event. Um, we It was just amazing, and these athletes men and women are so incredible. And before yeah. we let you go, uh, it's hard to get those tickets still for the trials. They were Correct. snapped up pretty quickly, but what advice do you have for folks? So go to verif the verified resale, which is axs.com. That's our ticketing system through Target Center and get verified resale tickets. There are some available. All right, good to know. Thank you so much for being here with us. Thank you. Of course, coming up in the next half hour, we'll talk a little bit more about the Parisian market, Promenade du Nord, taking over Nicollet Mall, and of course you can learn about some of the local makers. We'll meet one of the vendors participating, those details, and more straight ahead in the next half hour. Heather I know people AJ. downtown Minneapolis <laughs> and St. Paul are not gonna let the rain stop them from attending mm -hmm. this thing. It's mm -hmm. a huge deal. All right, thanks Shayla. Olympic trials here in Minneapolis. There are a ton of fun events yeah. all around it that you can check out. And the best thing is they go through the weekend for anyone wanting to go. Joseph's talked about this weekend's weather. Should be mm -hmm. great for it. Shayla Reeves joins us this morning to tell us more. Shayla, good morning. Hey, good morning to you, AJ and Heather. So if you're wanting a little taste of Paris ahead of the Summer Olympics, you don't have to go far to find it. Nicollet Mall is transformed with a Parisian street fair for you to enjoy. And I'm here with Mitch Berthum of Mitch's Markets and Jessica Ottman of Sienna Soap. Thanks so much for being here, both Thank of you. Thank you. Good morning. Yeah, so tell me about the market. You are the queen of markets, Mitch, all around <laughs> town. And this one has a special flair for folks trying to connect them with Paris and local. It does. Um, Minnesota Sports and Events brought me on over a year ago we started planning this. I started hand selecting vendors, um, most that had a Parisian flair to them or a theme or made products that related to Paris and then also mixed in um, our wonderful local makers that are in several markets and new, uh, new brands this uh, particular market and of course Jessica from Sienna Soap. Absolutely, and we'll get with Jessica in just a minute. What are some of the types of products people can find when they visit? If somebody wants a bouquet of flowers, we have a, a florist who is there who also sells beautiful plants. We have painters who sell uh, landscapes and, and beautiful um, momentums from Paris. 
we have a metal worker who does uh, lawn art and he has Eiffel Towers. So if you walk down Nicollet Mall and visit the 60 vendors, you will see something for everybody, Parisian related and of course American. And Jessica, what does it mean to you to be able to get your products in front of people that are coming here from all around the country, some maybe around the world? It's just so fun to show what Minneapolis has to offer in a little Minnesota nice and love and connect with people all over the world. Yes, and we've got just a few seconds here. Tell me quickly about your product and what you make. Yeah, so we have 100% natural skincare, handcrafted by my mom and I here in the Twin Cities. Um, we only use essential oils for scenting, no dyes, no perfumes. And soaps are olive oil based, so really moisturizing and nourishing. And Mitch, quickly, what do you hope people take away from their experience at the market? I think that this is such a unique offering and bringing it downtown just filled my heart because downtown is our special place. It's beautiful, the Nicollet Mall is absolutely stunning. Come down, meander through, promenade through, and just absorb everything and support the local makers. Oh, wonderful. Thank you so much, Mitch, Jessica, for joining us this morning. And of course, you can enjoy the markets through the weekend. Heather and AJ. Oh, the Parisian flair. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Something for everyone in downtown Minneapolis. Mm -hmm. All right, Shayla, thank you. Thank you.